All right, I'm using X15, and this was a plan that was posted on Chief Talk. And it's got a couple problems. It's got some stucco missing here, stucco missing over here, and this uh, footing, I think, extending up this wall. So let's look at a 3D. This is this is the plan after I've done some work to it, so it doesn't show all the problems. But this this section over here, these are all pony walls. They've got a stucco, a thick stucco top, and then a room divider on the bottom. And then they've got windows with an arch you can see this one I think needs to be pulled down well these over here seem to work but these are These windows go all the way to the bottom. And this one doesn't. So let's try to make it uh, 101. We'll make that 0. Well, I don't know what's wrong with this, but... Anyway, one of the one of the problems is that you you can see here at the top of this column there's there's no stucco right here. It's it, there is some over here. You can see it on top of there. I don't know why they're different. And I didn't do anything, I don't think, to make this this problem area over here go away. So it might be a transient thing. But anyway, I, I thought I would take a look at doing this the hard way, I guess, differently. And so this is a obviously a, a two-story structure. What I did was I built, I used three floors. And so that's, that's a floor right there. These arches are contained in the second floor. It's an open below room in there. And then these things are all on the second floor or the third floor. So there's a there's a there's our first floor. There's our second floor and this has got a low um, ceiling. That should be an inch, I think, and that should be zero because we have a one inch floor finish in there. So this, this, that floor is providing the floor finish, the floor structure. This is an open below room. So this third floor room does the ceiling and the roof, and that second floor room provides the floor structure. I'm not saying that this is the correct way to do this or the best way or anything. I'm just, I'm just experimenting. And then these are um, pass-throughs with everything turned off, and this wall, I wanted, I wanted to get, I wanted to get the stucco on these flat parts above the columns. So this upper wall is just a pony wall, and it has a um, the bottom part of it is a wall that's all stucco. If I were doing this, I would make these out of solids because I don't think Chief is going to 
If you were worried about framing, I don't think Chief was going to frame these like you would build them on site. And so I would, I would, th these are e easy to do with solids. And so that's, that's what I would do. And then you get away from all these artifacts from, you know, you're not going to, you're not going to get this wood showing here. And you're not going to get this thing over here showing and you're not going to get the wood. You know, there's just a lot of little problems. And this went together fairly easily. I didn't try to get it exact, you know, with the dimensions and everything. I just wanted it to kind of a proof of concept. But this is just sort of one way of thinking about doing things like this. Again, I think solids would be the way to go. Then you could just build it conventionally, two fours. Put the columns in here, draw your solids, and be done with it. <laughs>